on Netflix, I started watching a show called um, Land Girls. Actually, it's pretty good. I've been watching it for a while. And uh, it's about the wartime and the women that are sent to work in the fields. And it's good. It's dramatic again. But, you know, you got to have something go on in a show. So there's drama and uh, misfortunate pregnancies and whether their husbands, of course, are alive or dead. That's obviously a thing. Um, Cable Girls, I love the first part. I just found it's getting a little drawn out now. I think one thing about these shows is a lot of shows like when I watch Friends. Friends was only on Thursday nights. And so that's once a week, you know, you I tuned into Friends way, way back when, I don't know, in the 90s, right? And But you only saw it once a week. You waited for the next episode. And the same with a lot of the shows when we grew up, whether it was a bionic woman, it was on once a week. And I, I forget, like, Sunday nights or Monday nights, <clears throat> you know? Um, Wonder Woman, same thing. Once a week, you saw Wonder Woman. So when you watch these series on Netflix... You're not getting a once a week show. You're getting the half hour show, the next half hour show, the next half hour show, all at once. And you know, it goes on a very long time because there can be like two or three or four or five seasons and you're just sitting binge watching, binge watching them all at once. So you kind of start to get tired of it after a while. Um, and I think the thing is too, obviously they have to keep coming up with new ideas and new ideas. And you look at these soap operas that have been going on for a zillion years, <laughs> you know, and, uh, but even with soap operas, you know, you would watch one, well, that'd be once a day, but you know how like nothing really happens in, in like 20 years, nothing really happens. Well, same things happen. Somebody dies and then they find out they're alive. <laughs> um, anyways, but I've been enjoying Land Girls. I really like Cable Girls at first. Kind of burnt out on it. No, I haven't read lately. And no, I haven't weeded my garden. I'm looking out at my garden right now thinking, yeah, I haven't weeded the garden. Yet. That's a constant. No, I have here and there. Um... Besides that, I keep telling myself to get back to my hangers and making them my plant hangers. I got one right here. And I uh, gotta do that too. Oh, I had my grandson today. I had him from trying to pick him up, 8.30 until 1 or 2, something like that. 2, I think. So. Then I had a nap, because that tired me out. <laughs> I kept the grandson over, but then I am tired and I'm off to sleep. You got food in your mouth. You got food in your mouth. Yeah. Oh, uh, what'd you do to it? You touched the screen. I don't know what you did. I don't know what you did. What did you do? Did you touch it? Huh? Oh! Oh, you stopped it. No, you didn't. Very, very hot. Very, very hot here. <sighs> very hot. Yeah, I know. I haven't done anything in my makeup and stuff much or hair because you just sweat all day. You sweat all day, all day, all day. You sweat. You sweat. Hmm? Forehead sweats. My neck sweats. 
35 or something today out. Oh, 35 Celsius, or feels like 35 Celsius. It's, I've been getting on the treadmill every day, but I have a long ways to go now. And it all almost 54. It just doesn't come off like it used to. It doesn't stay off like it used to. <laughs> it doesn't matter anymore. It really doesn't matter anymore. But and the gyms are closed, so obviously not going to the gym. But I'm going on the treadmill. Yes, I just keep that up and. I go outside and walk. No, I wouldn't go outside in this heat. And I can't take the dogs for walks in this heat. She can't stand it. She can't even stand to go outside in this heat at all. My other one, the black one, he doesn't care so much. She can't take it. Her coat's so thick. Can you? You just can't take it, can you? I've been watching some shows still on Netflix. The cable Girls are so soap opera. Dramatic. Drama. Murders. It's, it's a little addicting. It's a little boring. It's not boring. It Well, see, yeah, some parts are boring. Um, I have fast forward some parts because it just drives me nuts. And then I watched that, uh, now I can't remember what it's called. And I started watching Queen of the South, and I just, I keep looking at books that I haven't been reading. I don't know why. I've always read. But, I've never been a huge TV person. I'd always read instead of watching TV, but, I don't know, some of these shows are pretty good. Really? What are you doing? Some of the shows are pretty good and I keep thinking I should pick back up a book or I have all the books on my phone too. And I think about it all the time, but I keep going back to watching these shows. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know. I always had such a love for books, and now I got watching these shows, and just, you know, I have a hair on my face, which is not surprising with all the cats and dogs. Boogie doggy doggies, it's the kitties that shed, isn't it? So yeah, it's the kitties. It's the kitties. It's not you guys, is it? No, it's not you guys. That's why I put this extra blanket on my bed, because, oh, the hair. You see that little bump? Where's the other one? No bump. I'm scratching it. I got one here. I don't know what they are. I think I'm allergic to life. <laughs> mm. I'm allergic to life. Anyways, no drinking. Give my kidneys a break. Give my wallet a break. Give my fat a break. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> the joys. Joys of being older. I used to be so skinny. Clothes are so uncomfortable. Ah. When I put on this weight and I have this stomach on me, it's like... Clothes are just... They're not right. Unless they're real baggy. They're not right. Yes, when I was like young, I wore tight, tight, tight stuff. High heels, tight stuff. Hey, Baron. But, I know it's all right. Ah, uh, hi, Bear. Got hair. Hair on my face. Probably a cat hair. Um, I got makeup underneath my eyes. 
I haven't been wearing my makeup a lot lately. I've just been going bare face because it's hot. Because I haven't felt like bothering. Because I haven't went anywhere. Because I've been home every day. Because this place is an absolute mess. <laughs> Hey, cleaning lady. Cleaning company. Are you cleaning company? I mean, not my company. Are you cleaning company to come in here? Walk in closets would help. Huge. Huge walk in closet. Twice the size of my bedroom. That would help. Mm -hmm. But, anyways, see, I don't have those things, so I don't know what to do with stuff. Anyways, take my daughter to Walmart soon. My daughter and my grandson to Walmart soon. Get some stuff. Oh, yeah. I said that. Old age. 